Hi guys, it's Adrian here from To Be To Serve. I've just finished my Facebook Live over in the private Facebook group From Survival To Success and it was all today about creating correct behaviour. So I do Facebook Lives in my Facebook group every Wednesday at 12.30 and the objective of all of these Facebook Lives is to help people understand a little bit of the perfect formula they need to be the best customer centric business for their customers. So it's called the perfect customer formula. It's my framework is how I work and what I deliver. But in each of these Facebook lives, what I'm doing is taking a specific element. Last week we talked about relationships. We talked about um, having, how people get into action, taking the next step. We talked about different barriers people have to overcome. And this week we're talking about correct behavior, you know, because behavior is one of the four key elements of your perfect customer formula. It starts with your vision, your purpose, your values, why you're doing these things. Then it's about the behavior you're gonna to need to deliver what you want to deliver to your customers. The third part is all about the customer experience. Actually, how do you put it together to deliver that customer journey from when they first discover you right the way through the length of their relationship with you over time. And finally, it's the leadership part. Who do you have to be to be the leader of your business so that you can deliver your vision, your values and your purpose to your customers consistently at a fantastically high level and deliver that extraordinary performance and the extraordinary experience that your customers are looking for. And it doesn't matter really on in the industry that you're in because if you are in a service business, that's where you know customer service looks the most perfect because it's live, it's there and then. But other businesses aren't quite like that, but we still have to deliver that level of service. And the hospitality industry was a great place to learn some of those skills and talents. But what I'm focusing on now is actually helping the businesses who want to change, who want to take their game up to another level, so that they can understand what structures, what foundations they need to put in place to their business, so that they can grow that and extend their profits, to extend their market, to bring on new products and services, and to serve their customers better and become a more profitable customer-centric business. So the four key core foundations that I look at are your purpose, your why. What's the purpose of your business? What's it there for? What's it there to serve your customers? What's it there to do for you? And in that, we're talking about the values and the vision you have, and also the roles and the purpose of the individual roles you have in your business are really important to get those right. The second foundation is all about the standards of behavior that are gonna let you and your team deliver the results that you want to deliver to your customers so that they go away satisfied. The third foundation is actually really understanding your customer's journey, how they're gonna progress from being a complete stranger to a raving fan. Doesn't matter what business you are in, every single one of us, we have that point of marketing, of attraction, attracting a customer in. Then it's about setting up their expectations so they start to realize what it is they're going to receive from us and get excited about it. Then it's the moment of delivery, of really taking that person into our care. Whatever we're doing, whether it's um, you're a law firm, architect firm, you're an IT business, it doesn't matter what you're doing as a business. Whilst that customer's in your care, receiving your transformation, receiving your products and services, we're totally responsible to make sure that their journey is really brilliant and their experience is brilliant. And there's thousands of different touch points that go on to make sure that happens. And then finally, the part of that customer journey is the nurture, how you look after them once they've become your customer. Because none of us are necessarily here just to do it just a one-off and gone. You know, if we're selling cheap stuff down the market, maybe that's what we're doing. But most of us are running businesses that we want to try and create some legacy. We want to try and create some connection with our customers so they come back to us again and again and again and really value all the products and services we have to offer. And then finally, the final foundation is the leadership foundation. Having the confidence, the certainty, the clarity about your business and how it operates and how you're doing it. And also really understanding how to develop the relationships that are gonna make the difference to your business. The relationships that are gonna allow you to leverage all the skills, the talent, and the abilities of everyone who works for you so that it becomes a really powerful and functioning and successful business. So please join my Facebook group, From Survival to Success, and join me every Wednesday at 12.30 for my Facebook Lives. They're short, they're normally about 10 to 15 minutes long. Today's was actually a little bit longer, about 20, but that just because a few people asked some questions, but they're short insights into specific things of those foundations that are gonna help your business grow. I look forward to seeing you next Wednesday in the Facebook Live. Bye for now.